Anthony Weiner is a disgraced former U.S. congressman who won seven terms as a New York Democrat. He resigned in 2011 after admitting that he had sent sexually explicit photos to six different women. Two years later, he was in another sexting scandal, posting photos under the alias Carlos Danger. In 2017, Weiner pleaded guilty to sexting with a 15-year-old girl and was sentenced to 21 months in federal prison. His wife, Huma Abedin, who was Hillary Clinton's deputy chief of staff and vice president of her presidential campaign, filed for divorce. Mr. Weiner is now a registered sex offender. Why would I kick a dead horse in this video? Easy. Mr. Weiner tried to punk my cousin. All right, everyone, uh, this is my cousin, Eric, and uh, this isn't the normal sort of content that goes on my channel, but he was just telling the most epic Anthony Weiner story I've heard uh, since the last time I heard about Anthony Weiner. So uh, I'm asking him to repeat that story and uh, verify for us. Okay, great. Hello, everybody. So uh, going back in, this goes back to September now. So this is one of the weirder weeks I've had in a very long time. Starting the week off on Monday, walking to work, and I go through the park, which I usually walk around 8.15 in the morning, and I see none other than Mr. Weiner himself sitting on the bench, all right? Didn't think much of it, but I did text my friends, who we all know the Weiner saga. Uh, hey, you know, I saw Anthony Weiner this morning. Tried to take a picture, it didn't really work. Anyway, didn't think much of it. Fast forward <laughs> to Wednesday, walking through the same park, it's actually on 9-11, believe it or not. And we are at uh, around 8.15 in the morning, same park. I see a, my buddy in front of me rides his bike. He's, uh, he and I stop, we start chit-chatting a little bit. We're about 30 seconds in to the, uh, to the story. And all of a sudden, there he is again, Mr. Weiner sitting on the bench, all right? I point very nonchalantly, and I'll stand up and demonstrate. He's probably about, you know, from here to the chair. So I nonchalantly point, hey, sure enough, there's your boy Wiener. So before I can even turn around, I turn around, bam, Wiener in the face, all right? I didn't know what to say. He's staring me directly in the eyes. All I can say and muster up is, hey, what's up, man? Next thing you know, he just keeps staring at me and he goes, yeah. That's what I thought. <laughs> Sean and I, both of our jaws hit the floor, all right? He starts walking away, and naturally, the only thing that comes to my mind is, hey, I'm not gonna get punked out by Anthony Weiner. So I start <laughs> shouting, hey, Carlos, aren't you a little too close to the school? <laughs> Keeps walking away, friends yelling, Weiner, Weiner. All right, didn't think much of it. Still very bizarre, very bizarre start to 9-11, to, to all right? Fast forward, it's now Friday, same park, got wiener on my mind, no wiener in sight. I look down, however, 8.15 in the morning, and there's a credit card. I think, okay, let me return the credit card to its rightful owner, let's, let's find out. <sighs> it's weirder. Pick up the credit card, it is none other than Huma. <laughs> Huma Abney, okay, what, like, what in the world, why is the universe trying to draw me to Wiener? I don't know why, I don't know what this, I don't know what the plan is here, but the universe is pitting me versus Wiener in an epic battle of all time. I won't, mark my words, the Wiener saga is not yet over, all right? It's just starting. We'll see what happens next. <laughs> Why did Anthony Weiner still have Huma Abedin's credit card long after their divorce? Are they still secretly an item? Was he allowed to continue spending her money in exchange for keeping his mouth shut about other political scandals? Why does a registered sex offender spend his time hanging out in a park near a school? Find out in the ongoing adventures of Carlos Danger! Danger!